Welcome to Insider Medicine In-Depth. I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Rates of infection with the drug-resistant bacteria known as methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus, or MRSA, diminished in Paris hospitals following the institution of a long-term intensive program, according to research published in the Archives of Internal Medicine. Here is some information about MRSA. It is a strain of Staphylococcus aureus that is resistant to the antibiotics normally used to treat it. Most MRSA infections occur in hospitals or other health care settings, but it has been found in the wider community. MRSA infections usually affect older people and those with weakened immune systems, but they have been seen in otherwise healthy individuals. Researchers from Group Hospitalier Petit Salpetriere in Paris report on the results of a program launched in 1993 by the Assistance Publique Hôpital de Paris that was designed to curb the spread of MRSA within the 38 hospitals the APHP administers. The hospitals included such widely accepted measures as isolating patients with MRSA say in single bed rooms, promoting hand hygiene and the use of alcohol-based hand rubs, active surveillance of high-risk patients, quick notification of MRSA cases and feedback on the results. From 1993 to 2007, rates of MRSA infection dropped by 35 percent. The greatest improvement was seen in the intensive care units, where patients are generally very weak and highly susceptible to infections. Following a 2001 campaign that promoted alcohol-based hand rub, use of these products increased from 2 to 21 liters in acute care settings per 1,000 hospital days. Today's research indicates that long-term intensive measures can successfully reduce the transmission of drug-resistant germs in hospital settings. For Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.